On Sunday morning, Sean Diddy Combs issued an apology for the 2016 video that went viral recently and showed him violently assaulting singer Cassie Ventura, his ex-girlfriend. The music mogul could be seen sprinting out of a hotel room in a towel and chasing a woman who looked to be Ventura towards the lift in the footage, which was initially obtained by CNN and made public on Friday. He pushes her to the ground, kicks her, shoves her, and drags her by her sweatshirt after grabbing her by the back of her neck. Later on in the video, he comes back to kick her once again before hurling something at her from a nearby table. The rapper stated in his Instagram post his sorrow for what he has done, and his behavior as inexcusable. He claimed he was in a spiritually bad place when the events happened. According to Douglas H. Wigdor, Ventura's lawyer, Combs' most recent remarks are more about him than the numerous people he has harmed. In response to Cassie and several other women coming out, he denied all of it and implied that his victims just wanted money. His pitiful desperation is evident in the fact that he had to apologize only after his repeated denials were shown to be untrue. Despite this, no one will be convinced by his bogus statements. The apology video that has now gone viral has had a negative response from the public, who believe his admission is not genuine, and the only reason he is apologizing is due to the blatant evidence and a desperate attempt at damage control. Sean Coombs, who has been under serious scrutiny recently, is facing a barrage of assault claims spanning over 15 years, with legal and law enforcement heavily involved with investigations. Despite the damning evidence of assault in the recent video, it's unlikely Sean Combs will be charged or arrested. According to an official Los Angeles District Attorney statement, if the conduct depicted occurred in 2016, unfortunately we would be unable to charge as the conduct would have occurred beyond the timeline where a crime of assault can be prosecuted. Despite this being frustrating for victims alleging Combs is guilty of a long history of assault, the statement goes on to say, they welcome anyone to come forward with any evidence of crime committed by Combs. With the assault video surfacing, Combs will have very little remaining support. It's just a matter of time before more damning evidence is released. Yeah.